Good morning guys, it's Taylor. Welcome back to my channel. Um, today is self-care Sunday, so I just woke up. I'm looking pretty rough. First things first, I need a bagel. I'm very hungry, so let's go get that. <laughs> Okay, my bagel is in the toaster, and now I have to unload the dishes because we have no more plates that are clean. <laughs> Alrighty, here is my bagel. I'm going to go sit on the couch and edit a YouTube video. Okay, two hours later, I have two YouTube videos completely done, um, edited, uploaded, scheduled to go public. I look disgusting. Disgusting. Anyways, I want to make some tea because this is like a Sunday reset and I feel like tea would help the mood. I also want to put on, put on, what was that? I want to put on the diffuser, make it smell really nice in here. So let's do that. <laughs> also, I just finished watching the new Grey's Anatomy and now I'm on the new Station 19. Um, yeah. Anyways, this is the diffuser. It's actually Alex. I've never used it before. But we're gonna figure it out. <laughs> okay, I'm assuming. Oh gosh, I'm spilling everywhere. Probably up to like that line. I'm not really sure. We have all of our diffusers here. One, two, three, four, five. That's probably good. Okay. Oh, maybe it's not plugged in. <laughs> okay, I got this to work. Now let's make some tea. <laughs> this is the cup I'm using. Alec and I have matching ones. They are super cute. Okay, I'm gonna put this in the microwave for like three minutes. Okay, I really need to clean just like the counters in the kitchen. Everything else is clean, so I'm gonna do that really quick. This is like one of my favorite teas. I know it's like throat coat, but it tastes so good. So that is what I'm having. I'm almost out though. And then I always put like a little bit of honey just to make it a little sweeter, but usually this tea like tastes so good. I don't really need the honey, but I like sugary things. So I add it anyways. <laughs>
Okay, so now we're in the guest bathroom. Honestly, not very many people use this because Alec and I have our own bathroom, but I still want to kind of clean it up. So I'll just do a quick little clean. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> Okay, guest bathroom is clean. I just mopped that, which is awesome. This is Aurora's room where Vashi slept over. It slept there, but this is all clean pretty much. So the last thing I need to do out here is vacuum um, and obviously like take care of my plate, but everything else is clean, which is awesome. Hey guys, um, I'm in my bathroom now and I'm just gonna clean the mirror and the toilet. I just cleaned in here like two days ago, so it's not like that bad, but I just wanted to do a touch up. Um, I am going to my parents tomorrow night, so I want to be able to like come home to a clean apartment, so that's why I'm cleaning everything. Okay, so I just went shopping and I need to take off all the tags off of everything and then put it all away. So that is what I'm doing right now. So I control the volume. I like to dance by myself. So I can do my own moves. Okay, sorry, the TV's on, but I just wanted to show you I'm making pancakes for my cookbook right now. So they're almost done. I'm ready to flip. So Oh gosh, they're burning. Ooh, that's a beautiful one. I've never actually tried um, making these before. They're homemade peanut butter oatmeal pancakes. Um, so hopefully they turn out well. Hopefully they taste good. Um, yeah, so I need a plate. Oh, I just remembered. Shoot, I was gonna take um, a couple banana slices and put them on top of the pancakes for the picture, but I forgot. Dang it, that sucks. Well, whatever. I'm watching Good Trouble right now. I think it's on Hulu. I'm not sure, but yeah, I'm watching that. Waiting for my pancake. Okay, this is the second batch. I accidentally made this one huge, but this is what they turned out to like look like. Super yummy. There's just a random one. Um, they're like kind of like dry, but they're really good. So, thumbs up. Hey guys, um, it's been a while since I talked to you. I've just been relaxing, and then I got ready. So I'm wearing Nike 270s, Lulu biker shorts, and then Nike sports bra, and then this is my Whitworth cheer jacket. And I'm gonna go pick up Foshi, and we're gonna go on a hot girl walk adventure. Let's go. Good morning, my love. Afternoon. Good morning. I'm filming a Sunday reset.
Okay, hey guys, we just finished our hot girl walk. Uh -huh. We did like three miles. How was it? It was beautiful. We saw a lot of funny people, which was nice. Had lots of cute dogs. So many dogs. Yeah. Okay, hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that little montage of our hike. I just dropped off Vashi at her dorm. Now I'm going to the gym. Um, I feel like that's like a Sunday reset kind of thing. It's like go on a walk, get outside, go to the gym, like reset. It felt really nice. Um, Vashi gave me this chocolate muffin. Um, she actually gave me two. I've had mine. I ate like most of it, half of it. Um, and now I'm going to the gym. So, yeah. Okay, we are back in my bathroom because I am going home for a couple days. Um, it's spring break right now, so I need to pack. Ready? This is my makeup bag. Um, when I'm home, I'm not really doing anything, to be honest, so I don't really need to bring much. Um, mascara. eyebrow brush that's that's literally it like I'm not doing anything so I don't need to bring much um, makeup remover towel razor just in case I probably won't I mean I will shower but like I don't really need to shave my legs hair comb toothbrush we're flying so I'm not bringing toothpaste um, hairbrush and then I am on my period so that means a bunch of tampons and pads and stuff just in case is there anything else I need oh deodorant um where is my deodorant I think it's down here Deodorant, maybe like a hair scrunchie. Um, hair scrunchie just in case. And I think that's it. Dental floss is at my parents, so let's go pack this in my suitcase. I'm sitting on the ground because I'm trying to pack my clothes. Let me show you what I got so far packing cube okay so I have one pair of lululemon leggings and then I have um, these joggers from lululemon they're comfy and cute then I have sleeping shorts and around the house shorts then for shirts i have black crop top black crop top one bra for wearing it with this whitworth university like sweater little thing then i have socks and underwear and a sleeping shirt and i need one more outfit for tomorrow for the airport because like around the house i don't know like i could wear this to the airport when i come back the joggers the shorts around the house i guess i could just wear the leggings tomorrow and just wear them twice or wear my sleep shorts during the day one time i'm not really sure my camera is losing battery um do i need another shirt i'm just trying to pack minimal um because I'm only there for like three days and we'll probably just be in the house a lot. Like we're not going anywhere. Also, if we do go anywhere, I can just use my mom's clothes because we fit the same size in literally everything. So I really just need like pants, to be honest. So I have like my, my joggers I'll wear on the airport coming back here. But if we go out to dinner or anything, I'll just wear those because they're like respectable. So... I feel like maybe I should bring one more nice shirt just in case we go out to eat. But then again, I'm like, I could just wear my mom's clothes. So I'm not like too stressed about it. Um, maybe like 
Here's my issue. I'm I'm supposed to be getting a package Thursday. Um, we get there Wednesday night. So if the package comes in time, I'll have another two pairs of pants. So I'm like, why am I packing so many pants if I'm gonna get there and I'm gonna have pants? Does that make sense? So, yeah. I think I'll just wear these tomorrow. I'm gonna pack tennis shoes and then wear my Birkenstocks just so they're comfy um, on the airplane. And yeah, I just need like a shirt and maybe like a jacket. Maybe not a jacket, I can wear my mom's jacket. So really just like a shirt for tomorrow. Hey guys, so I'm at a coffee shop right now trying to get ahead on work, um, which is really important on a Sunday reset to get ahead and try to get ready for the week. So yeah, I've been here for a while just working and the coffee was a 10 out of 10. Um, yeah. Okay, so I just finished up at the coffee shop. I feel like every Sunday I have to like get ahead on school work for the week. So that was really good, super helpful. Um, I love that coffee shop. It was called Revel or Revel 77 Coffee. And I just, I would recommend it to everyone. Coffee was great, service was great. They had music, but it wasn't like blasting. Um, what else was I gonna say? And yeah, in the bathroom they had tampons like for people to use, which I thought was just so cool. I'm like, every restaurant and coffee shop should have that. Like that is just so cool. I love the feminist energy, love the support. I just thought that was really cool. So yeah, I had a good experience. Now I'm actually gonna go out to dinner, I think. Not dinner, lunch. Okay, I decided to come out to one of my favorite restaurants. It's called Mackenzie River. Um, yeah, I feel like this is like a treat yourself Sunday, not really like a reset, but I'm taking myself out for lunch, so yeah. Okay, this is what I got. It's pulled pork and fries. It looks so good. It is so bright. Anyways, um, I hope you enjoyed this little Sunday reset, get happy with me kind of video, and I'll see you in the next one.